The Cleveland Guardians wrapping up the regular season and getting ready for the postseason. Let's welcome in Senior Vice President of Public Affairs for the Guardians, Bob DiBiasio. Bobby, appreciate the time. Uh, when we talked, we talked about watching uh, young guys grow and do their thing, and they've done it pretty well uh, all season long. Uh, there's been the ups and downs, but uh, youngest team in baseball, and they're getting ready for the postseason. Yeah, remarkable the way this young team has come together. And thanks for having me, David. Uh, always a treat chatting with you. Um, you know, five and a half, um, six months ago, when we broke uh, out of Goodyear, Arizona, uh, we really were wondering what type of identity that this young team would create. Uh, how they would grow and develop both as a team and as individuals. And we saw a young team, as you said, the youngest in all of Major League Baseball. There's AAA teams that are uh, older than us that um, we see a relentless uh, brand of baseball. We see some would say an old fashioned style of baseball where you pitch it and you catch it. Uh, you put the barrel of the bat on the ball and you run the break bases aggressively. Um, these kids have just been so fun to watch uh, uh, with the leadership of, of Terry Francona, the winningest manager in franchise history, uh, and his coaching staff uh, just been wonderful. And the way they took care of business here in mid-September, um, just remarkable. I, I have to say... We played a stretch of 18 games in 17 days uh, with Minnesota and Chicago right in the midst of all that, the two teams that were chasing us. And our guys go 16 and two. Uh, they took that challenge head on, uh, no matter how many obstacles, 12 double headers, et cetera. Um, they met every challenge and good for them as they get to uh, play in the postseason. So October baseball, here we come. 